Hey guys, it's me, Bullish Place here, and I actually have a funny story to tell you guys. But before we get into that, welcome back to another Lifeboat Prisons episode on the channel. And of course, guys, this is Lifeboat Prisons on the Xbox One. And, well, yeah, it's, it's the Xbox One, which is the Minecraft Bedrock Edition, or Minecraft Pocket Edition, because it's like the same engine, I believe. But welcome back to another episode on the channel. If you guys do enjoy this series, please drop a like on today's video. It'd be greatly appreciated. Plus, I want to talk about a few things that Lifeboat actually improved upon. And you guys can tell right away, look at my hotbar. Your grade, gold, and next level gold amount you need is displayed. I'm grade W, and where I'll get into the explanation pretty soon. I have 35 gold. Yes, I, I know I'm pretty broke right now. And I basically need almost 450k gold to level up. But this is the thing I was going to talk about. They have a brand new friend system. It's the Friends of Party Beta. And I think this is the greatest addition they have ever done so far. Why? Because now I can do Lifeboat Prison Streams with you guys. And I will definitely do that if we hit, mm, let's say, 75 likes on today's video. As soon as we hit 75 likes, I will start a stream and we're going to give this a go. But I think it's pretty simple. Like you hit add a friend and you put in your name. My name is BullishCloud5. That's my gamer tag. I'll even do this for you guys. There's my gamer tag, BullishCloud5. And we'll just give it a go. I think it's pretty cool. I mean, you can have requests. You can block players, start a party. And just, it's really, really cool how they finally added this to Lifeboat Prisons. I know it's for the Lifeboat Network, but this is just, I'm mainly on Lifeboat Prisons all the time. Plus, guys, I believe Mindville, another Minecraft server, has their own prisons. So I might give that a go in the near future if you guys are really interested in that. Just comment down below if you guys would like to see that. Now, story time. I already have episode 8. This is technically episode 9 right now. But episode 8. I had a huge YouTube noob moment, a bruh moment, whatever you want to call it. But I have the gameplay, but I do not have the commentary because I accidentally deleted it. As a YouTuber, we use two things. We use a recording software. I use Audacity. A lot of people use Audacity, which has my audio put elsewhere so I can actually improve it. Get rid of the background noise and all that good stuff. But the file and the project, I deleted it. And I went to finish editing the video because I was still in the process of it. It was two hours of footage, it was gone, it was, it's ruined. So this is what I'm gonna do. Enjoy the little montage of basically what happened in episode eight. This is still gonna be titled episode eight, but technically this is episode nine, but enjoy. But yeah guys as you guys can tell I did quite a I did quite good in PvP. I'll, I'll give myself props. I didn't die. It took me a while to how you get the health back. All you had to do was just basically back out to the main menu and come back in. But you know, I'm pretty proud of myself. Yes, I did have a sharp three sword, so I kind of had an unfair advantage. I don't know if people don't know that you can enchant their stuff, but most people don't even buy a plot. But you can have a plot now. It just costs a lot. <laughs> Cost a lot, I'm not gonna lie. I am gonna make a video pretty soon on how to level up from scratch, but I'm gonna do that after I basically hit grade Z, then I'll just make a bunch of tutorials for you guys. And that should basically wrap up my Lifeboat uh, series. 
Don't worry, I'll still be playing it. You guys can give me suggestions on what to do. I still have a bunch of fun challenges I want to do. For lifeboat, uh, the grind is almost done. I'm very tempted just to reset because you can reset, but it'll be kind of pointless since I have to repeat everything. But you guys can leave me suggestions down below on what you guys really want to see after I hit grade Z. Also, shout out to all the brand new subscribers. We have actually surpassed 820 subscribers as of today, the day I'm recording this and the day I'm uploading this because it's going to be a fun, fun day because I need this video out there. I'm not sure if we're going to grade up this video. I'll try. This is quite a hefty, hefty grind now because the main reason why the last episode took me so long to play because I played for two hours is because I needed gold. Just Mm, did that footage? I'm still salty, but I'm glad I was able to save the best parts, which was just me mining, getting a, you know, a higher grade. It took me a while though because I I didn't realize how much gold you really need to level up. Because I mean, this is pretty much almost a hundred gold per block. I know it's ninety. I really need to find emerald because that's the really the one closest to hundred. It's ninety five. But you need so many blocks to get there. And as you guys can tell, I'm I'm pretty broke because I uh, I spent all my gold just to get into this mine. I don't mind it at all. See what I did there? You know, mine, mine. Okay, uh, cheesy pun out the way. But yeah, this is gonna be quite a hefty, hefty grind. And if you guys do enjoy, I won't like I honestly don't mind dragging out the episodes now. Like I don't have to grade up every single episode, but it's still my goal. But I also don't want the series to end so quickly because I'm pretty shocked that I'm about to, I'm not even at episode 10 yet. And I might actually hit this goal of hitting grade Z by maybe episode 10. If I drag it out, maybe like episode 15. There's still a lot I want to do on this server though. Don't get me wrong. Plus I also want to try out other servers, other game modes because Lifeboat has a lot to offer. I mean, I didn't even have dungeons. And I have yet to play a dungeon type of game in my life and I would just love to give it a go. Plus, I mean, I believe they are dropping a new Minecraft game next year called Minecraft Dungeons. So if that's the case, I'm gonna be all over that. Sadly, I'm so broke that I can't even afford an efficiency pickaxe. So what I'm gonna do is get this roll done, then I'm gonna go back to the plot, enchant, and all that good stuff. I like how I still didn't get that row done, then go, but let's get this row done, then I'll go enchant my pickaxe. I just get so carried away. All right, that's a sign. Hello there. By the way, guys, I want to show you guys this also this cool other addition they did. I, I don't know if they always had it here, but I don't know if they always had it here. Sorry, I had to reply to a text message. But let me unmute the chat. So when you enchant, success, 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 and if you do it one more time, no. I don't know what just happened, but damn, that, that chat was interesting. Don't come near me or my man. Okay, Minecraft. What what just happened? I'm gonna I'm just gonna mute the chat. Interesting chat there though. I'm I'm gonna say it's, it's muted. Let's go back to the mine. One thing I wish that this prison did have though, it's just like other ways of getting gold. Like I mean, mining blocks all day is a lot of fun sometimes. It might be a little tedious and repetitive, but it's it's kind of fun though when you actually have people here to mine with you. By the way, guys, I'm still down to do that. So let's use this new party system. I'm gonna have like at least like ten subscribers. The first 10 subscribers that can actually like add me on the system and send me a message, like whatever it could be. My Xbox, I play on Xbox by the way. I'm, I'm pretty sure I make it obvious. Like, I am playing Lifeboat Prisons on Xbox. My gamer tag is Bullish Cloud 5, just like my main channel name. If you guys are into Call of Duty and all that, but Bullish Cloud 5, I showed the gamer tag earlier. I'll, sh I'll just type it across the screen. One more time for you guys. Send me a message here. One episode, I plan on having subscribers with me in a mine. I don't, it doesn't matter what mine, cause you can go to any mine you want. You just had to hit, you just got to use the chat aspects. And also shout out to everybody who gave me like advice with the commands. Cause I did not know you can actually transfer servers. Uh, gave me the best time to play PVP, which is on the weekends. I appreciate everybody who's actually very helpful and supportive of the series. I mean, I have a lot of you guys who message me saying you guys watch my videos. You guys go on the playlist and watch it over and over again. I appreciate it so much. I just had to make some type of video. I had to save this footage somehow, and I thought this would be the best way of me grinding a little bit, show you guys a little montage. If you guys did enjoy that aspect. I mean, I had some very interesting music, not gonna lie, <laughs> but hope you guys did enjoy. Also, might as well just say this. If you guys see that I am online, because I do add back most of you guys. I add most of my subscribers back. That's my goal. Not everybody, but basically if you see I'm online playing in Lifeboat Prisons or just Lifeboat Network, 
feel free to join. And if you can find me, just crouch. Just crouch and catch my attention. Do something to catch my attention. I do have the chat on most of the time. I just m mute it whenever I need the... Basically, whenever I have to talk, I make sure it's muted. When I'm just mining, I like to, to read the chat because sometimes people are just kind of crazy. You guys saw earlier. <gasps> Emerald, thank you. You are a blessing. I'm just going to yoink all this from you because I don't think you know what you're doing, but I am going to yoink all of this. I have yet to see an emerald block, and oh my god, this is actually a lot. What, what block is that? I don't know. what That's snow. There's actually snow here. Oh, that's going to be annoying. But this person, appreciate you. You just showed me the emerald, and I'm just going just gonna to take all the emerald from you. I don't think you, uh, you know what you're doing. I uh, appreciate it. This, is the, this stuff costs a lot more. I'm going to give you guys one tip, though, in this video. When you're in a mine, make sure you grab the stuff that costs the most. I mean, I have, like, kind of, like, OCD habits of just wanting to mine perfectly. When I mean perfectly, I mean I'd start from, like, one corner and just work my way around. But make sure you grab the most expensive stuff. Like, in this mine, it's the emerald. I did not realize it was snow. This is going to be annoying. Not as annoying as the sand mine. The sand mine, oh my gosh, if you guys recall that, that was horrible. Or the obsidian mine, that one, I couldn't even stand it. I couldn't be in there no more. There's actually quite a lot of emerald. Why didn't I just look for just emerald? I mean, I don't mind. Although I am called the diamond goat, so like I'm used to just diamond, but I guess you guys can call me the emerald goat now. Yeah, I gotta evolving my nickname here. And who gave me that nickname, you might ask? Me, myself, and I, you know, yeah. It's pretty cool, you know. I do really appreciate this person that showed me the way to the emerald. Also, guys, you guys are into crazy crafts. I'm going to have an info card right now. Uh, check it out. I'm, it's a series that I do on this channel besides prisons. As of right now, those are going to be the two main series on the channel. Lifeboat, prisons, and crazy craft. My favorite, favorite mod ever for Minecraft on the Xbox One. Shout out to Elder Wizard Gaming. Really appreciate you. He's the mod guy. He's a good friend of mine. And yeah, if you guys actually are subscribed to him, he's actually one of my good friends now. Funny story, he just came by to one of my streams. And that's, that's, all, that's all that happens. And the funny thing about it, I was a huge fan of his before he even stopped by my stream. So I, of course, being myself, had to act like a fanboy. <laughs> just like how you guys act sometimes when I invite you to my party. Like Pickle Pop-Tart and everybody else. Like, it's really... I enjoy those moments. They're very, they're very wholesome, basically. What I'm probably gonna do is just mine till this pickaxe breaks. End up so there. I'm pretty sure I'll hit 250k. I'm pretty confident. Or I can just get like barely like 175 or something like that. But I'm pretty confident we can hit the goal. But yeah, guys, next episode I'll make sure to have it be a PvP episode to make up for well the failed pvp episode i'll make sure it's dedicated just purely to the pvp mine so if you guys are interested in that leave a bunch of tips down below on how uh to make sure i survive that also might be our shortest episode we'll have in a while because it's gonna be just mainly me and pvp i'm not gonna be grinding a whole lot i'm just gonna go for how much loot i can get from people and yeah it'd be kind of cool well, there goes the pickaxe, boys, and there's so much emerald that I leave behind. Can I get out of this maze, please? Alrighty. That was such a lovely grind, but uh, let's just go over here and see how much we make. Uh, let's see. Oh, my. Oh, I like how I fall in every single episode. No, okay. All right, here we go. Diamond. I'm not even gonna hit 150k, am I? I I have a feeling I'm not even gonna hit 150k. Oh my gosh. I am broke. I well, hope you guys did enjoy today's video on lifeboat prisons with bullish plays. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. I know this episode wasn't all that entertaining. I just had to do something to save this footage, and this is the best way I can do it. But if you guys do not mind. Drop a like, subscribe, and notification to be appreciated. And comment down below your favorite part of the video as well as tips and tricks for PvP because the next episode is going to be strictly PvP only. I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Lifeboat Prisons on the good old Xbox One.